So here we are in the beautiful E43. Um, one of the great things about this car and, and, and actually doing these videos is we get to look at all of the cars, drive all of the cars, and give you some perspective on the vehicle. So this car is the next level. I mean, Mercedes obviously makes safe cars. They make you know, advanced cars. Technology is wonderful in the 21st century for sure. And this vehicle is an interesting car. Now this is the E43 AMG. And as many of you know, we make the E63 AMG and then there's also the E300. Well, the 43 is in between obviously the, the 300 and the 63. So this gives you a little bit more power obviously without the price point of the 63. This is a bi-turbo six-cylinder engine. It's 362 horsepower. It is wonderful being the bi-turbo because you have, you know, the old AMGs, even the old ones, the, the 55, even the, the E55, those, those had, you know, 380 horsepower. These have pretty close to that. And you get the gas mileage of an everyday driver. This car is extremely, so it's every bit of Mercedes. It's comfortable, it's quiet on the inside, yet when you step on the accelerator, you have that power. Um, interior wise, you can see that the AMGs have a lot of different features. For example, the flat bottom steering wheel. This also has the carbon weave trim. It's beautiful, it's like a weave carbon fiber, very nice. This car has the dual LCD screens, the 12.3, so it's digital on both sides. Um, and it's just a fun car to drive. Now, it's an everyday driver, has all the safety features that our cars are known for, the blind spot assist, the surround camera, the collision prevention assist plus, the brake assist plus. This vehicle has pedestrian recognition. Um, it's a wonderful, wonderful daily driver. It's quick. It even has the eco start and stop mode as well, which can be disengaged simply by pushing the button. And then we have the dynamic driving modes, which I'm gonna put this bad boy in Sport Plus because I like to drive it. A little more aggressively. Listen to that. So we're gonna get over. Great car. Almost 400 horsepower in this vehicle, so it can get you to where you're going very quickly and very safe. We're gonna take a back road drive here. So one of the nice things about this car is how easy everything is to reach when you're driving the vehicle. Um, radio controls, Bluetooth, navigation, everything's at your fingertips. Um, for example, if you go here to the touchpad, you can actually just swipe with your finger. See, and I'm still focusing on the road and I can still do everything I need to do right here. Um, navigation is here, radio is here, and you can actually simply, by changing the radio station, you just swipe down, scroll to the next station, and then push down on the button, and it'll actually bring up the next radio station. We're gonna go this way. We'll get on it a little bit on this back road here. And see, it goes. It's got some power. It's very smooth, very comfortable. One of the things that's nice about this vehicle, because it has the electromechanical steering, no power steering fluid is necessary. It's, it's a speed sensitive steering system. So as you get a little faster and it stiffens up the steering wheel a little bit, these cars turn on a dime. I'm gonna actually go up this way, show you how this thing maneuvers. One of the things that comes up in conversation when, when I'm discussing vehicles with people, you know, everyone has their own taste and there's a lot of different features about every car. No one's making a bad car today. As a matter of fact, everybody's making a great car. And one of the things that come up with the Mercedes is what we're known for, which is our safety and our comfort, you know, the luxury on the car. But then, you know, listen, we want power and this vehicle has power. Um, 
and it's a it's a good power it's low end power look at the instant throttle response car goes as soon as you hit the accelerator the interesting thing about this car is how it fares in the real world as a daily driver big seats it's a 14-way seat it's comfortable everything's easy to reach tilt telescopic steering you can paddle shift air vents are here um, I even like radio for example I'll show you we'll turn up the radio just a little bit and I'll demonstrate like the talk button so if you push this button here you can actually give it a voice command to even turn to satellite radio satellite radio and see there's a Sir Sirius XM preview and then if I want to scroll to the station like I like pretty much everything it's just for the sake of this go to 80s and there you are and it has grace note technology so it's able to put up the name of the songs as well as the artist and the cover the album artwork is pretty um, so it's very nice but it's a good daily driver I'm still driving this vehicle in sport mode and to go back to comfort mode I simply just push the dynamic select button and the vehicle will automatically take me back to comfort mode when you're driving the car you can actually feel the transmission shift and everything and the rpm level goes down uh, we're going to go back up but it's very nice this vehicle is also equipped with as many of our vehicles are the uh, apple carplay and the android auto um, and there's the connector right here um, for that system and then we have the NFC charging as well so you can actually place your telephone here on top of the console and it will charge your telephone now be uh, keep in mind that not all the telephones have the NFC charging capabilities um, you have to check to make sure that your phone is equipped with that but if it does it will work in this vehicle um, you can still Bluetooth uh, my big my telephone my personal telephone does not have NFC so I simply Bluetooth my phone into the car which will give me uh, my, my Bluetooth audio and my phone connectivity for hands-free operation for my telephone calls um, it's a wonderful easy uh, convenient feature as many of you know most of the cars today I don't I don't even know of a, of a vehicle that doesn't have Bluetooth um, but this car is a great daily driver it's it's perfect for someone who says hey I need a mid-sized vehicle um, I like my horsepower but I still want a daily driver I still want my comfort I still want my smooth ride I still want my luxury um, the e300 as well particularly the 43 this car is a must look at you have to put this car on your list if you're considering um, a car with that type of horsepower I mean and that type of capability this car is priced right at I mean really well equipped at the $80,000 mark so looking at um, all of the features out there and the vehicles that are out there this is this is a car that has to be on the list I wanted to give you a, a flip a quick uh, flip here to show you how the turning radius is on this vehicle so we're gonna go up just a little bit and I'm gonna flip it around so we can go right here just watch this on a dime great love the car I love how quick it is I love how responsive it is and I really really enjoy how comfortable the vehicle is a lot of our clients that come in and one of the things that I hear a lot from my clients is that vehicles that they're driving you know I sit a little bit low to the ground and they're not able to necessarily get in the vehicle or find a, a comfortable seating position and this is the first car uh, that's in our inventory that I bring out to show people uh, the comfort of and how easy it is to get in and out of uh, if, if your back isn't the way the back you used to have and and things like that this is easy to get in we have big doors you can slide in and the tilt wheel is a very easy feature to use to give you some additional space and it's, it's very very comfortable uh, Mercedes has done a great job of incorporating the comfort of the car getting in and out of the vehicle um, and the space inside I mean you have leg room you have elbow room um, it's very comfortable this seat can go pretty far back I mean I don't know pretty much any height can be comfortable in this car whether you're really tall or even really short you can really find a good seating position um, everything's nice one of the things that is a great advantage for this LCD screen is just visibility in the vehicle you can see everything everything is clearly marked 
particularly at night, you know, as we talked about with these vehicles, these E-Class cars with the 64 ambient colors at night, you can see everything pretty brightly. But this, this new uh, LCD screen is marvelous. Everything is crystal clear. Um, day or night driving um it even you know being under the dashboard one of the things i was going to point out um it it blocks out that you know sunlight so you the sun is this is like a sunshade so you can really see everything clearly day or night and it's pretty bright here in arizona so the visibility is marvelous in this car the steering and the handling is nice too and it's very very comfortable great car now it's just, I don't know if you can see that on, on the video, but the eco mode just kicked in and the car just completely shut down. Um, it will show, will display the green A here on the instrument cluster to let you know that the car is in eco mode in addition to it, of course, not running. Um, and the second I lift my foot off the brake, it fires back up and we're off and going again. So that feature can be disengaged simply by pushing this button, but it's a nice feature. It does save gas around town. Um, and to be honest, I haven't driven the car throughout the city long enough to, know, to, to tell you exactly how much gas you save. They, they tell us for every five times you fill up, and one of those fill ups will be for free if you use the eco mode. So that's pretty nice. We also have the auto lights, you know, that are here lights would turn on and off automatically we have the stardust lighting as we talked about in the rear for better visibility so people you know other drivers can see you pretty clearly in this car this vehicle over the previous e-class it's about two inches longer than the previous car so it's a little bit bigger but elbow room is great visibility is great power is awesome and because we're wrapping up here, I definitely want to show you one more time just how responsive this vehicle is. Nine-speed transmission in this vehicle. Um, it's very smooth, very, very responsive. I love driving this car. Anybody would love driving this car. Mercedes cars are magnificent cars very comfortable that's my big thing uh is the comfort i love the safety features um i love the sportness i love the luxury i love the power but i, I the comfort is the big thing for me one of the fascinating things about mercedes i've been with mercedes a long time and one of the things that's interesting about our vehicles is as they get older you know you put some miles on them you get 50 60 70 thousand 80 000, even 100 000 miles one of the wonderful things about them is they maintain you know that tight strong ride even as they get older you know you drive a mercedes with a hundred thousand miles on it, it's like driving a, a mercedes with you know a thousand miles on it so they've done a wonderful job of making these cars have great durability and keeping that nice ride over time love the way this drives one of my things is I tell all customers and clients who are looking at or even considering our cars, you have to drive one. You have to come out, meet with, you know, find a dealership and, and meet with your salesperson and make a call or whatever and, and get behind the wheel of one of these cars because this is where they really excel. I mean, I could talk about this car till I'm blue in the face and there's all kinds of safety features and things that we can go over with the car, but, but the proof is in the drive. You have to come on drive. I always tell my clients, Come on out, make some time, give me some time, give me a half hour of your time during the course of the day, and we can actually take this car out for a test drive, and you'll be as impressed with this vehicle as I am. So we're gonna pull back here in the dealership. What a wonderful test drive that was. Great car. All right, folks, we're back. I'm Rob Myers. As always, my pleasure talking with you, going over the video with you. Ask for me when you come to Mercedes-Benz of Arrowhead. We'll take out an E43, an E300, um, any car you want. We'll take it out for a test drive. Thank you so much.